Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll show you how to set up Flutter on your Windows PC with Android Studio. Okay, let's get started. If you have already installed Android Studio or if you haven't, doesn't matter. Uh, I've already installed Android Studio on my PC. So if you want to configure Flutter on your PC, I would recommend you to first install Android Studio. Okay, so after installing Android Studio, you have to set up Flutter so that you can uh, create a new Flutter project or open existing Flutter, Flutter project and work on work on it so the first thing you have to do is you have to go to flutter.dev to download the windows sdk so i'm going to flutter.dev and here clicking on get started and since i'm on windows clicking on windows and then i'm choosing my platform which is android and in this page it will show up the uh, sdk download link so here we have two options use vs code to install and download to install click here and this download then install flutter page uh, section will show up here this is the windows sdk for flutter this is zip archive so download it by click clicking on this button it will start downloading once you click here i have already downloaded it for this tutorial purpose it is 1.6 gigabyte size so after uh, after downloading extract it with your preferred software like 7z or winrar etc i'm using windows default one Clicking on extract it will take some time to complete the extraction once the, once the extraction is done uh, you will see that a folder called flutter windows version hyphen stable and that folder will contain a folder called flutter and this is the folder with the sdk files so just cut this folder and place it in a directory where you will not do any changes i like to put it on my c drive directly i'm pasting it here and after pasting it here go to the bin folder and here the, the main flutter files for windows is present so copy this path and search for environment variable here the best match is edit system environment variable i'm opening this and clicking here on environment variable and double clicking on path and here all the path will show up now click on new paste the flutter bin folder path click on ok then OK here and finally OK here. Now Flutter is actually successfully installed on your machine. So in order to do that, let's open my CMD and type Flutter Doctor. It will run a Flutter check tool to see if Flutter is OK or not, as the command suggest. So if you have installed uh, Android Studio, then you were uh, ready to get started from android studio from here but if you are not then you can install android studio even in this in this phase of your installation no problem so meanwhile when flutter is checking for if everything is okay or not let's go to android studio and after opening android studio it will show up like this and here you will see three dot click here and click on sdk manager here on this page click on sdk tools and you will see a option called Android SDK command line tools latest not installed check this one and just check this one and click on apply and it will show that uh, the SDK of command line will be installed click on ok and let it to install the command line SDK it is 136 megabyte of size and and flutter is also checking the dependency okay so let it to complete it will take some time when the android sdk command line tool is being downloaded the flutter doctor command return a response and it is saying that uh, visual studio is not installed and license status is unknown so uh, we don't need to be concerned about visual studio because we're not developing anything about windows we are developing for android so only thing we need to do here is we need to we need to agree to the flutter android licenses right so here the command is also visible here just run this command and paste it here and place enter it will prompt for your agreement with the license it will ask you for a yes or no if you agree or not i'm clicking replying with yes 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 and yes and yes and yes so i'm agreeing the license agreement with flutter and it is saying that all licenses 
are accepted so now here the android sdk installer android command line sdk tool is also downloaded successfully click on finish and click on apply and click on ok so once again on this page then click on plugins and you will search with flutter the flutter one is already showing up on my uh, by default page if it is not you can search flutter and install the one which comes from google okay so clicking on this plugin for android studio and after installing it is asking for a restart clicking on restart now we can see that a new flutter project window is showing up so my android studio is fully configured for flutter development so now let's create a let's open an existing project which is a flutter project and let's see what happens just asking to download the dart sdk and it is successfully identified that it is a flutter project and that's why earlier there was nothing here in this configuration but now it is uh, successfully selected main.dart but now on my android studio it is saying dart sdk is not configured okay so open dark dart setting here uh, in the flutter sdk part you will will configure the uh, flutter sdk path so click on here go to the flutter click on ok and it will identify the version of flutter so flutter is successfully added now click on ok and the error will go away okay so so flutter is successfully installed on my machine now i just have to resolve the dependencies and run the project and and start working on the project okay that's it for this tutorial if you face any issue you can let me know in the comment section below i'll happy to answer and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thanks once again for watching